welcome back. Today I have a short video showing you how to install vinyl decals. This bike has a lot of track related upgrades including this extra tank and some shark skins fairings that I'll show you later. The tank has a slingshot racing quick release gas cap, a pro grip tank protector and stump grip padding. It's a very functional track tank but it felt incomplete without Ducati decals. So I ordered some from AllOutGraphics.com and I'm going to show you how I installed them. First, you need to clean the application area with soapy water. Rinse, dry, and wipe it clean. Then, using alcohol, conduct one last wipe down of the entire work area. This will remove any oil or gas or soap residue that may have been left behind. Once this is dry, you'll be ready to install the decal. You will need a water soluble pencil or marker, a squeegee, and I used some painter's tape to help with the installation. I have to give All Out Graphics a shout out. These decals are good quality, good color, and a good match to the factory decals. They have a huge selection as well. You can probably eyeball the placement of these decals, but I wanted a little more precision. So, using some painter's tape, I came up with this method to establish the starting point on the tank. You can see that I basically have a straight line across the top of the tank connecting the end of the decal on the left side to the beginning of the decal on the right side. Here's what the initial setup looks like on the track tank. You will see in the next couple of frames that on my first attempt the angle of the decal is a little high. So I measured the gap on this side above the eye in Ducati which is about nine millimeters up to the crest on this part of the tank here. Mark at least two adjoining reference points on the tank and the decal. You can see my marks here on the decal and here on the tank. Then peel the backing off of the decal Take care not to touch the adhesive on the back of the letters. Then simply line up the two marker points previously scribed on the tank and apply the decal. Break out the squeegee and, working from the center of the decal outwards, make sure there are no air bubbles under the decal letters. Take your time and do this right while the protective cover is still on the decal. Now it's time to slowly lift off the decal protective covering. If you completed the previous step correctly, this part will be a breeze and all letters will be solidly adhered to the tank. Take your time, do it right, make sure the letters are locked on. And voila! You now have a professional looking decal on your tank. This is a fairly simple project and while I only applied four small decals today, these principles apply to other larger decal installations as well. Now don't forget, there is another side waiting for you, and now you can go ahead and finish that. And now to close out, here are a few parting shots of my bike. I'll see you the next time. Good luck.